Gut. <laughs> okay, guys, and back in watering waves. Hold on, uh. <laughs> I should have tested uh, moving around first to reduce the lag. Okay, yeah. Uh. Dash also. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, I think it's better now. Okay, so. I still cannot uh, play Act 5 because I need to go Union Love 21. But I actually passed that. I just need to do this Ascension. <laughs> okay, just like Genshin, I have to do the Ascension to go next uh, level, next rank. So I'll do this first. And then we'll play Act 5. Now I try to do like one act of video if possible. Just like Genshin lah. A new story I play in one video. But yeah, I need more time actually yeah, if I want to do that. <coughs> I cannot just give myself one hour so I have to actually find the right time. <laughs> so I'm going here. Contact thing. I'm curious to who is this? Is this uh is this the developers? <laughs> what test? Okay. Complete the trial, okay. What do I press? Oh wait, I have to go somewhere else. Alright. <clears throat> so I assume after I do this ascension thingy, I can play Act 5. Because I already passed the uh, required <laughs> to go to level 21. But I'm locked at 20. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> Alright. Oh yeah, I did consider maybe playing it at mobile because I already downloaded on mobile but I don't know, I feel like the combat is much easier to control when you're on the laptop. On mobile it's a bit hard to control your combat. Nice but cool. Oh yeah, data bank also uh, I'm kinda capped. Can I actually go to 8 but I'm stuck at 7. Alright, so here. Ooh. Face Ascension 1. Lower than recommended is fine. I'm assuming this next act we have to go above 40. Alright, let's see. 3 minutes. We've got 8 enemies to fight. We are level 43. Okay. What is this music? There's three, four. The hour is upon us. Let me be your blame. Storm, hear my command. Swift and resolute, one with the sounds. Synchronization. Oh. Bask in the sunlight. 
Swift and resolute. No hesitation. A moment of resonance. Let me be your dream. Synchronization. I the sounds. Leave it to me. There we go. <laughs> Alright. Oh, co op mode. Let's go. Okay, I finally can co op. That's good. And now I'm level 22. Data bank level as well. Okay. <clears throat> oh, so co op is at 22. Eh? I think I did mention when I saw it last time, but I forgot. <laughs> And yeah, I already got all this already, so 7 days. This event I haven't started yet. Uh, I can do that later. Another time. Okay. Focus on the story first. Alright. Let's play Act 5. I'm guessing all the enemies are gonna be tougher now. I remember when I tried the GN battling the Tacit boss. Wow, that was so tough. I was it tough, but I was half HP down. <laughs> so I'm guessing the enemies are gonna be that tough after this. Right. Now we can do the next one. Act 5. Let's go. Can I can I fast travel here? Yes. Okay, so Yang Yang and Shishi as usual. <laughs> I see. Yes. Ooh. I can feel the tension in his dreams. I see. I'm worried something bad is gonna happen. There you are, Rover. Remember to check your terminal signals and wear the Academy's protective suit correctly. That's not what she said. <laughs> and don't forget to stay hydrated. Yeah, that's the now, that's the line you're supposed to, to see. Take care. The academy has noted a concerning rise in tacit field activities. Please use caution when exiting the city. Okay, that it's was just Baija being Baija. There's a delay on the text by one line. I think it's cute. <laughs> anyway, Rover, quick, tell us what happened. Okay. You didn't mention, okay, you mentioned Jewel. The Fraxidus again? Oh, those jerks. Gian the General. Hey, you what's see the it? magistrate. And Jue. The ginger is sentinel. Is there any kind of connection between them? Connection? No idea. <coughs> but I did hear General Jian used to be a military doctor. Oh, Jian a doctor? What's a doctor? Hmm. Speaking of that, I think we need to start with a bit of Jinjo's past. A storyteller near the theater once told us something like this. All right. The Honorable Madame Jinzi, our great magistrate of Jinjo, was handpicked by Sentinel Jur. Her status as the Sentinel's appointed resonator is rare among all past magistrates. Our Jinjo was leaderless for years until Jur finally chose her to be the next yeah, magistrate, so and she answered the call. To further elaborate, we must start with the battle beneath the crescent. 
The Norfolk Barons, scarred by countless wars, discarded weapons scattered like bones. Our soldiers had fought to reclaim the land for years to no avail. Overthrax, the dreadful Thrinodian monster, fed on the frequencies of weapons, turning our fallen soldiers into deadly tacit discords. So they become so they are human. Just human turns to confront the threat. As Twin Moons alive, General Geshulin vowed to vanquish evil, raising his blade against the blood red crescent that foretold destruction. General Geshulin. His sword blazed with black flames, laying waste to all who dared stand in his way. Victory seemed certain. But until the retroact rain began to fall. Retroact rain. Raindrops fell upwards as in the past Ooh. monsters raged. Royal souls fell to blood soaked sands. Infernal carnage. Drop Issuing upwards? his last command, <clears throat> Geshulin demanded all soldiers stand firm no matter what happened. Holy shit. Sacrificing his body to the black flames for power, Geshulin charged at the Overthrax with all his might. Overthrax. And he was never seen again. After the fall of their leader, the remaining soldiers despaired until a deafening roar of Chin Long struck like lightning. The Lions bravely stood up to lead a hard won retreat. After the battle, that young man who tamed the wind ascended to fame, becoming the new general of the Midnight Rangers, selected by Sentinel Jur. Also selected. On the other hand, General Geshu was blamed for the massive losses that occurred under his command, earning him a notorious reputation in Huanlong. That battle struck us hard, but our sentinel rose from its long slumber to select a new magistrate who will guide us into the future. Despite the previous disaster, Jinjo was off to a promising start under our sentinel and the new magistrate's guidance. The people held hope for a better tomorrow. Okay, that explains it. <coughs> that explains the history. I'm hearing about all that. Uh, maybe the Sentinel had its own special ways of picking candidates. Or maybe it is their incomprehensible ways that set these divine beings apart from us. Their thinking tends to be elusive to the average person. Yeah, true. Wouldn't be surprised if Jue decided to make me the magistrate one day. Not gonna lie. Does he ever ask the opinion of the person selected? I wonder because. <laughs> We met Jue as well, but uh, I understand your concern. Let's start the game. Madam Jinshi was only a teenager, Ooh. and she was suddenly selected to be the magistrate. It must have been so difficult for her. I remember people were skeptical when she first took office, despite her achievements. Many believed she lacked the necessary experience and authority in the political realm. People only showed their respect to Madame Jinshu because they trusted Jue's judgment. Seriously, Lord Jue knows how to choose him. Our previous magistrates were all top notch at running the show. And Madame Jinshi, she's already made the city a well oiled machine in no time. I have a mental overclock just trying to keep up with all that paperwork. She was made for this. But what is that saying again? Real gold never loses its shine. Rover, since you were asking about this, did you get clues from your past from Madame Jinshi? Find Jian in the North Pole Barons at a specific time. There's another overseer at the Fraxidus lurking in Jinso. An organization called the Black Shores has been watching me. Okay, so this is the like extra. This one goes to the next one. I, I, I want to see what you say. The North Pole Barons? It's been a battlefield since ancient times. Rover, it's dangerous there. The Marvel 
Barons is the front line in our defense against the Thermodian. We must be careful about going there. Rover, since you were asking about this, I sent two overseers at once. <laughs> Don't know about the black shores. Ah, the flower, yeah. And it's only a photo, and I can't tell where it came from with my ability. Studies the lament. Remembers where it's a flower like this. Hmm. We're still in the dark about Fraxida's plans, and the Morphal Barons is too risky. The black shores seems to be our only option now. That. If we are to look for them with only a photo of this flower, it's going to be difficult. Since it's about flowers, we should go ask Grandma Lin. Yes, Grandma Lin runs a flower shop. Right, I'm sure she can give us some tips. <coughs> <laughs> You're making me blush a little. Grandma Lin I'm loves listening to, to storytellers. I think I saw her earlier. Let's go look for her. I guess that character is part of the Black Shores later. Alright, Act 5. Yeah, Act 5 already. Yeah. I heard Act 5 and 6 is the best. So I can't wait. Why are we talking to Lin Su? Oh, hello! Qixia, Yang Yang, what brought you here? Hey, Grandma Lin! We're here for some stories today, and here's our new friend. Ta -da! We've got the ultimate badass here, the one who can crush TDs, <laughs> cook up echoes, knock Inferno Rider flat, this is and this KO too, yeah. Salian Beringal with a single punch. The legendary Rover! Oh my, you're such a sweetheart. Hey, Malin, since you're the flower expert, a... I got a favor to ask. Have you seen flowers like this one before? Hmm. I'm familiar with most of the flowers local to Jinjo. Oh, the locals don't know about this, this flower. One, oh, it doesn't match anything we have here. Is I don't this even think a real I've seen flower? anything similar. Not even in the plant yes, encyclopedias. It may not be a real flower, but yes, how they... Oh no. If not even a flower expert like you can recognize it, who else could help us? Oh, Chisha. I'm far <coughs> from an expert. <coughs> We've got a plant type resonator here in <gasps> Wait, plant Blanda? type resonator? She knows the plants much better than me. Are we going to meet. Are we going to meet Verena? Oh. Are you talking about that young lady? I always see her helping out at your store. Yes. Oh, she, oh, yeah, she gonna she be has Verena. been a great help. She knows a lot about plant everything related. plant she related. And she is such a sweet child. Her smiles always make me happy. She reminds me of the lovely star flowers. I'd call out to her, little star flower, it's dinner time. And she'd always answer Do with you have the brightest smile. What a lovely girl. Really? Uh, that's a cute nickname. Where can we find her? She's probably up in the back mountain doing some field research. I said I wanted a field in the back mountain to plant my flowers, and she offered to help right away. That's where she is back now, mountain. checking it out. Go in that direction, and soon you'll see a wall. Thank you so much. I can't coming. know where this is. I think I explored a part of this. Oh, see if I'm right. Anytime, dearie. Don't forget to visit my Penjing shop. Okay. <coughs> um, yeah, I already opened uh, this area. You sit there. You sit. Yeah, yeah, it has to be Verena. Who else would it be? 
say resonated. This should be the shortcut to the back mountain. It is a shortcut. Once we cross the waterfall, we'll reach Mount Ping Ting. What? It's a shortcut behind the waterfall. Are you serious? I didn't know this was a this was a road. Huh. What's this? The flowers seem to be showing us the way. It's Verena. <laughs> it's Verena. <laughs> It has to be. Okay. Okay. Oh, something else. Oh yeah, I did go here, but I took a shortcut. I didn't go all the way here. Okay. Oh, let's talk a bit. You know, still only one dish I can cook. <coughs> okay. A bridge of flowers. <laughs> That's impressive. Are we going this way? Yeah, if I was here. Is this it? Is this the place? Yes, there she is. It is Verena. Kind of new. <laughs> Hello, are you lost? Do you need help? Starflower, that's what my grandma Lynn likes to call me. Oops, sorry. I should have introduced myself first. I know it's a polite thing to do in Huan Mong. It is. It is a delight to make your acquaintance. I am Farina. My pressure to have the opportunity to meet with you today. My pressure? <laughs> <laughs> My apologies. I used to live in the New Federation, so I'm not very familiar with the language here. Hi, Farina. I'm Chisha. This is Yang Yang, and he's Rover. Grandma Lin told us we should come find you. <laughs> oh, right. Grandma Lin talked about you. I left those flowers so she knows how to reach me. What seems to be the trouble? If there's nervous. anything I can help you with, we're looking for a special flower. Does she know this black flower? Hmm, it's an unusual flower indeed. Pure black flowers are rarely found in Might nature. Oh. We can't rule out the possibility that it's been dyed. When looking at the structure, there are a few types of flowers that seem similar. Take iris, for example. Its petals are similarly oval shaped, but it has double petals. And it's not viola either. Since viola has notched petals, then there is also the cliff recluse. But this flower has a longer stamen and an extra petal. <laughs> Lemongrass is also similar in shape. It's native to the New Federation, and Hanlong people may not be familiar with it. Though it has a similar stamen month, it has a conical inflorescence with a trumpet-shaped corolla. Oh, and I almost forgot the peacock flower. It's a single petal flower so with a similar stamen month. But the peacock flower has a distinct so peduncle, while this one doesn't. Wow, oh, you really know your stuff. I learned a lot from that. Anyway, this black flower does look very special. There are hardly any similar plants in nature. So I'm thinking it might be a newly cultivated species. New species flower? Also, its veins are somehow cross-shaped. I can feel some faint traces of frequency fluctuations on it too. 
It's a sign of overflowing remnant energy. So, my guess is it should be a unique remnant plant created by a certain type of resonance energy. But in order to figure out the right soil for it, or exactly what type of resonance <coughs> energy it is, <laughs> I need more than just a picture. Hush, help us out, someone. We don't know what kind of flower it is, and we haven't seen anyone wearing it either. Speaking of that, how does it even work? If I wore this flower on me right now, <laughs> do I automatically become one of them? Shizia, wait, what did you just say? Uh, yeah, I was just saying, if I wore this yeah, flower, that makes sense. would they immediately if, see me as one of their own? It has to be that rare. If it's if it's not that rare, everyone will just use the flower and it makes sense. If this black flower is indeed their symbol, the black shore members should immediately notice it on yeah. you. But to everyone else, it's just it a normal just flower. Look like a peculiar flower, given so... that if they are indeed in Jinjo City, we may only need to wear this flower to wear them out. Yeah, that's the thing. How do we get one? Yeah. But how do we get our hands on one? Um, I, I, I could probably make one for you with my resonance make a ability. Pink one. If you just need something that looks similar. Come on, Verena, you can do it. You do a fake black flower? Alright. No way! That's amazing, seriously! It looks exactly like the flower in that picture! <laughs> Thank you, it's nothing. I'm glad it could help. It's <laughs> just a fake flower. It's right. freaking amazing! Could you do that again? Please, I love it! Is someone... Is someone spying on us? No? <laughs> Wait, where's the angle? Oh, she saw something. Huh? Alright. Rover, did you see that? Miss Farina just conjured up this exquisite blade bloomatic and it looks exactly like the one in the photo. Um, it's just my resonance ability. Could you please make another one? Then there'll be one for each of us. It's sure, I'll give it another try. So we're gonna get three of them. <laughs> Alright. Farina's the <laughs> only one that so far that I'm using before I meet in the story. <laughs> the others I'm not so hyped about it yet. <laughs> okay, so let's see what you're hearing. Find, found something. Similar patterns of my way here. What is it? for a while now. <coughs> they're scattered all over the place. I'm pretty sure all they're not the made by Miss Farina. The streams have been disrupted. Someone has been following us. Oh shit. Rover, are you sure you want us to leave? It could be dangerous for you. Okay. Trusia and I will wear these black flowers and go look for members of the black shores in the city. <laughs> they will be in the city, I don't think so. Over. Maybe they are. Please be careful. Ring us anytime when you need help. I want to know who... I want to know who are the black shores here. And let's investigate. Oh, black metal. A faint ominous aura. You seem to have seen them on their way here. What? Okay, where the sound is coming from? Is someone following us? Oh, Yang Yang is here, hold up. Oh, I see! And guess what? Miss Farina just made an easy peasy! I've got this, Miss Farina. We should get you home now. Oh, uh, sure. One moment, please. I wonder if Verena knows someone is around. Alright, let's see what that is about. <coughs> we need to treat Abby and Yang and Marina here now. Uh, it's 
those guys? Why are they here? The Fraxidus? Yeah. What are they doing in a place like this? Damn that woman! Always getting in our way! And what are you doing here? Get lost! I'll have to take them down first. What are you two doing here? Level 42. One with the sounds. I guess I know this. The weird noises persist. They're coming after me. The weird noises persist. I'm not sure what's the weird noise, I'm probably not hearing it. <laughs> this is great feather. Oh. <laughs> and listen. The music is at the stop. <clears throat> we have to go up, okay. If I climb up to that point. I got should time be able to get behind that person. Clear out the stalker, okay. Wait, I remember going up here. <laughs> yeah, when, when I went here before. To open the area. Who's stalking me? Better hide here for now. <clears throat> Is this someone we know? <gasps> oh shit! It's the girl that's that from the start. Holy shit, that's her power? Oh. for me oh here you are holy shit, shit. okay she's like a person i'd be kind of help <laughs> What is that pose? You're such a box full of surprises. Why are you following? Me? So we're playing truth or dare now. I see. Oops. Holy shit. <laughs> Getting angry, are we? Sorry, but it's just so much fun to rile you up. Very first person to pique my interest like this. You have great potential. Okay, so you're not up for small talk. I'll keep that in mind. Wait, you're a flower. my mission target after all. Yeah, she's the she's from the black shores. <laughs> Bingo! She has the black I'm one of the bloom bearers of the black shores. Okay. This Blake Bloom is our symbol. It represents our mission to save the world. Right. That's what it says in the rules, at least. Our plans. Hmm. What is it again? Oh, it to again? recruit as many talents okay. as we can and save the world from its impending doom. So are you in? Sound like you. Oh, nah, -uh, I don't. The world couldn't care less. Okay, so if it's all going go. boom tomorrow, why not have fun while we can? Yo, this is a this is kind of awkward position here <laughs> to stop it. Nothing for more power. Take down any prey without mercy, and indulge in all our desires for the ultimate pleasure. Huh? It's 
excuse me. <laughs> How are you any different from the practices? Well, I mean, I'd love to live that way. But alas, duty calls. The Black Shores, our garden, is home to many green the fruits. And we'll make you the most special seed among them all. But the seed again. My duty is to nurture and safeguard seeds like you, allowing them to seed. blossom into luscious fruits. Oh, gosh. Then, once the fruit ripens, I'll get to pick it and indulge the sweetness of my labor all by myself. You're just like what civilization simulation sand table Tethys has told us. Yeah, I, I can feel such <laughs> explosive potential within you. One day, you'll surely bear the most beautiful fruit imaginable. What is this no phrase? Need to be so and this position in this position. I as won't well. do anything this is strange <laughs> to you. I think. I think. Actually, I've been diligently protecting you, you know. I got rid of all types of pests that tried to get in your way. Ew. She's, Don't mention so she's me in the Exodus in the same scene. sentence. I couldn't care less about their petty games, but if they even think of laying their dirty fingers on you, <sighs> you're mine, and I don't like sharing. Oh. <laughs> Just a couple tricks and I had those fools flapping around like headless chickens. What a boring crowd. Tricks, those fools? <coughs> Whoa, don't tell me you haven't noticed. Enjoyed your nightly rendezvous with that long maiden. You have me to thank for keeping those Fraxidus people away. Oh, so she helped us a bit. Well, I've answered plenty of questions already. Now it's your turn. Oh, she. This is how you treat the talents to try to recruit. What do you want to ask? <laughs> Nothing in particular. The way you look at me, though, it's almost as if... No, forget about it. Finish your sentence, then. What? But I'll be watching you. You're a very special seed. That I'm very sure. Again with the seed. I can She's feel something oddly familiar about you. Oh. Oh, shit. Okay. It's a warning. <laughs> and she is. Who are you? What's My your name? name? Is Camellia. Cam Camella. Cam Camellia. Why not Camellia? Cam <laughs> Why is that why? Okay, sure. Camel Camellia. Alright. Try not to let me catch you so easily next time. Ten. And she's gone. Huh. <clears throat> that was fast. Okay. So that's one member of the Black Shores. Ten. Is she playable? Helper, <laughs> what took you so long to answer? Did something happen? A weird woman. Another stalker. Is that stalker. a friend or a foe? Are you hurt? The Black Shores. Did she tell you anything? Phew. At least you're safe. Shizya noticed a guy acting suspicious. I think she's keeping an eye on him. Another guy now? Sure. We are in the shopping district. See you then. Okay. Level 23. Let's go. Camel Camellia, huh? She looks like she might be a, another boss, but I don't think so. I hope she's like a playable character soon. 
<laughs> I wonder, you think Scar can be playable? Or at least like an enemy. Where am I going? Okay. Wow. <laughs> Holy shit, okay we met that stalker girl from the start of Act 1 Camellia, Camellia Okay Okay <coughs> Why are you still you are. looking at Yang Yang? <laughs> Uh, how's it going? We walked the streets, wearing the Blake bloom like you said. Talked to various people, but I didn't hear anything useful. Shinsia <coughs> did say she found someone suspicious. Look, it's him! Cool. Oh, perfect timing! This guy's been sniffing around here for a while now. She keeps trying to is talk to the elderly and miners. Oh, I've I'll, been keeping an eye on him. Yeah, it's that that guy, the white guy. I got that character. Oh, Alta, Alto, wasn't he? And I saw a little girl with him. She kept turning her head and looking around, but now she's nowhere to be found. She gets this is head. super fishy. Well, he's a resonator. Hey, I'm Patrol Achisha. Sir? Business license, please. <laughs> yes, yeah, also license. okay. Yeah, uh -oh. I forgot the name. I'm Altel, just a humble information broker. I've been traveling around, helping people out in my own small way. I see. So no license. I bet you don't have a fixed business location either, huh? Business location? Why would I need that? <laughs> hmm. Now show me your organizational accreditation, please. Well, I'm an honest broker of information. Always open to negotiations at the right price. I'm the all-time Intel champ with more bestseller certificates than I can count. No license? <coughs> no clear business plan? You're running an illegal business. Then... Um... Who's your supervisor? You should at least have their ID number. My supervisor. Oh, right. She's like a super big deal. She's an ancient being, born of this planet we're living on. She's the will of the star, the reverberation of everything in this world. Uh, are you for real? So do you even have a supervisor or not? <laughs> she, she, but I... What? <laughs> Come on! I already told you about her! Is she even a, a job supervisor? Yeah, yeah, I believe you. I know what's going on. Now, sir, you're coming with me to the patroller station. Oh, come on, please. I didn't do anything illegal. I was just looking for someone. A little girl. Um, about this tall? She's the kind of stand out in any crowd. Cannot be for you, that must be someone else. You really think I'm gonna buy that? Wait. There is someone who's similar like Verena. On call? No, oh, you know. You saw her earlier. It's that girl. A short girl, a big head girl. She seems to bounce when she walks. Yeah, exactly. Wait, how do you know? We didn't even meet her yet, right? But... <gasps> it is! And Verena together! Oh shit! It's Encore! What is this? <laughs> Here you are! Hooray! Who is this? Who is this lost child? <laughs> Encore! 
I've looked oh, everywhere oh, yeah. for you. I didn't Back even know if you should leave that girl alone. Miss Patroller, she's the girl I've been looking for. So she's a supervisor. Hello, little one. Is your name Encore? Do you know this person? Who are you again? <laughs> yes. Okay. Encore knows him. Uncle Altol sells stuff Uncle without a license. Altol. He listens in on people for commercial without secrets, us. and he loves pulling pranks on us kids. But he's not a bad guy, really. Ah, oh, Encore. Remember our little chat? What did I say about calling me Uncle in public again? I am not that old. Cliff on my way home, she was eating a poisonous mushroom. I managed to make her the antidote in time. Imagine what would have happened if I wasn't there. Don't worry, Encore's had plenty of that mushroom already. <laughs> but why did you go to such a dangerous place alone, little Encore? Because of? Also. <laughs> God damn it. We got your back, little one. No worries. Just tell us what you know. Because... Because Encore must keep an eye on him. <laughs> uh, kids can have such wild imagination sometimes. <laughs> hey, Alto! Didn't you just send Encore there? Wait, why are they all giving you the side eye? <laughs> Encore! Some things are better left unspoken, you know. Since the situation has come to this, I've got no choice but to tell you. Indeed! We're here for business, and it's a crucial one. You wanna know what it is? What is the hell? What the hell is this? Let's go, Encore! Did he just ask you? Hey! Wait for me! See ya! We still have a world to save! If he made a run for it. <laughs> Wait! <laughs> <laughs> we can't let him get away! I I'll go search in the residential area. Listen up! Um... What is this? It's posed in a weird way. <laughs> Did she leave you to mock you? What the hell? Ah, what is this? Is he mocking us? I'll go down that way towards the patrol station. Oh, what the? I know the streets here like the back of my hand. Okay. Well, since I'm really nice in the story, and I'll use him. <laughs> I have Alto, I do not have Encore. So. Alto? What is this? <laughs> Misfigures. Mocking us. Here's another split in the road. I'll go look for him in the square. I'll leave the other side to you. The Marina's dash is so cool. What is this magic tree? What the hell? The gaps between each mist figure is shrinking. Over there, at the end of that alley. There you are. <coughs> Okay, what is this? <sighs> well, we weren't really running from you. We just wanted to make sure you were alone. Oh, you're just splitting me, splitting him up. Be good, please. Encore and Uncle Alto won't do anything bad to you. Jinzo speedster. <laughs> what is this? Just call your uncle again. What do you want? That's enough, Encore. 
They're freaking our precious clients out. Encore just did as Alto said. Encore is usually a good girl. No way these guys are also black shots. Don't thing. be scared, Rover. I think we just have a few questions for you. What is Was it? it your idea? To have those two ladies wear those counterfeit plate blooms and attract our attention? Uh. Admit, they look quite convincing. If I was an outsider, I might mistake them for the real deal. So, you worked with a plant type resonator. Interesting. Yeah, Verena made that. A plant type resonator. We happen to know someone like that too, don't we? Yeah, there are more than one of them out there. Not a big deal. Oh, yeah, it's not just Verena, this. I guess that is Camel Camel Camelia or what? Also kind of plant type. So please tell us, <coughs> what do you want from the Black Shores? Uh, now you're fighting, finally fighting the hook. What should I tell you? I told you, we have the information you want the most. Like what they say here in Huanglong, the straight hook is for willing fish to bite. Da -da -da -da. Your efforts finally caught our attention. Surprise! The people you've been looking for are right in front of you. What does that mean? Now, how's that for a piece of intel? I'll let you have it, free of charge. You're both from the black shows? I don't see it, the black flower with you too. Oh, not that disappointed look. Are we not what you had in mind? No, I did not expect the two of you to be. I know you must have a ton of questions for me, but one moment, please. As you already know, I'm an information broker. That means I make deals instead of passing out freebies. You want information from me? You gotta give me something in return. Okay. <laughs> Relax, Rover. We just want to make a deal with you. We want you to come with us to an abandoned Court of Savante facility to help us recover a resonance beacon. In turn, I'll tell you everything you know so far. Uh, why should I trust you? And if I say no? Our business is centered around customer satisfaction and built on integrity. Otherwise, we wouldn't qualify as consultants of the Black Shores. And since you're a first time customer, I'm pleased to offer you an additional gift. What? Huh? Here, have this. This should prove we're serious since you already know what it represents. And if you still have doubts about us, just show it to that plant-savvy young miss. She'll be able to tell, finally, as a last resort. Encore! Do your cute face! Quick! Uh, what? We'll be waiting for you near this beacon in Whining Ice's mire. And don't forget to come alone, okay? God damn these two. Okay, I didn't know these two were the black. I didn't expect that. Rover, did you find them? What? Seriously? No way. Oh, so that's what they gave. As I expected. This flower is indeed a type of remnant plant, and it contains a very unique kind of remnant energy. The concentration is much higher than usual, too. No way! Are they really from the Black Shores? <laughs> Not as mysterious as people make them out to be. Well, at least they're good at running. I'll give them that. What did they tell you? Uh, 
Now I'm curious how the sound works. Oh, I don't know how, how they play. I, I know Gen C. I've seen a bit of it. Because of the dangerous weather conditions and whining Ix's mire, it's been ages since anyone went there. Don't worry, Yin Yang. We all know how strong our rover is. Okay, rover? I'll tell the Academy about this, and they'll help transmit your data from the Resonance Nexus. Then, that beacon in the whining Ix's mire should be unlocked for you. There have been frequent tacit field activities recently. If you're going there alone, Please be careful. Just ring us whenever you need a hand. We'll come rushing. Okay. Peculiar blink. Now. <laughs> Alto. Am I supposed to use him now? <laughs> I don't know. I. I Okay, well, I think I'll still use Marina and Yang uh, Yang. Okay, are we going? Oh, whoa! It's a new area totally. Okay, I have to unlock that. Well, then, uh, yeah, we need to go here. It's not fast travel there, can we? Oh, we can! Okay, we don't. <laughs> We don't even have to travel all the way there. It's already open. Thank goodness. Thank goodness that one is open already. But the map is totally not open yet. So far. Caught me by surprise. <laughs> and there's the two of them. Holy shit, what is this? It's raining. What the hell? <laughs> Hold on. Okay. The yeah, extra dialogue, man. Hey, Rover. I've sent the coordinates of that CSC research facility to your terminal. Now that we're in the same boat, let me fill you in on what we're getting into before we dive in. The Corda Sabante is a mysterious scientific research organization. They're best known for their research in automata mechanics. But what really put them on the map isn't that. It's all the bizarre experiments they did. What's with the psychedelic black light coming from Morning Ice's mire? And is that freaky ring in the waters really the lake monster's doing? One day, a daring young scientist soared into the sky and never returned. Could this be the beginning of another diabolical plot? Also, why are you telling bedtime <coughs> stories now? Is it time to sleep already? And then what happened? I want more. What kind of stories have you been listening to? Ahem. My bad. Old habits die hard. But the big part is coming right up. One day, out of the blue, every single Corte Savante member Banished the last words from that mysterious researcher, the Corte Savante Committee's chairman, was this. Ahem. You want my research? You can have it! I left everything I gathered in the Corte Savante's labs. Now, you'll just have to find it. What do you think, Rover? Aren't you curious? Uh, let's go. I'm leaving now. <laughs> I knew you'd be into this like I am. But stories aside, we do have an important mission on our hands. I suppose the Magistrate of Jinjo has already told you what we do? We've set up resonance beacons worldwide to monitor the lament, collecting oh. data in real time. This is how we predict when the next lament is happening. This set up the as the saying goes, okay. one miss is as good as a mile. Every single one of those resonance beacons is crucial. After the Corte Savante researchers disappeared, all of our resonance beacons Damage. near their facilities were damaged to varying degrees. Recently, something went wrong with our lament detection system, and we suspected it had <coughs> something to do with a damaged beacon around the area. That's why we've been sent here, to investigate the case. While our main goal is to retrieve the lost resonance beacons, 
We also might find some treasures. Also, even Encore can tell what you're up to. It's called Seize the Opportunity While I Can. <laughs> you're just too young to get it. Come on, let's go. Alright, an hour in. And we have to go here. Well, I... To be honest, I would like to level up uh, Alto. But everyone's level 45 here. You know what? I don't have I don't have encore, right? So I don't have to level just level him up lah. Huh. You never fail to impress. My mister reach even further now. Sweet. And that'll be another intel on the house for you. It's a gun user. Okay. Yeah. Let's see what you can do. This is a four star weapon. I will use a bit of this. <coughs> Should I make it 40? Well, I'm not sure why not. Let's see what you can do. <coughs> How do I quit setup? Alright. Let's see how good he is. Um, let's make him 20. 30. Let's make him 30. Alright. And Verena just in case. Because I do not have Uncle. <laughs> let's see what you can do. Ooh, okay. He does, he does do those, uh, misting. It's like doing uh, like the echo thing, but it's actually a miss. Maybe it's for distraction. Eh? For for now only, I will use auto in the team. For immersion. <laughs> but you know, all these guys are now forty four. I think I should level up my character to forty plus as well. business. What's that do? To be safe, I will level up to 40. This might be this might take a bit longer to fight <laughs> if I stay low. What do I need? Ah, what is this? I need a pack 
chop flower and what is this uh, okay I can't go to 40 then <laughs> I need certain materials mysterious code okay that one I have so yeah then I can't even ascend it Is my TV detector working? Oh, what? How come it didn't run as soon as the discord's ahead? Because they all just appeared out of the nowhere. Oh, okay. That's weird. Anyway, let's deal with that, shall we? Swift and resolute. really love their puzzles. <laughs> no wonder folks never managed to get inside after all these years. Going in here? Their security's top notch. That's because Alto set off the security alarm and now the gate's closed. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we've got to figure out how to open it up again. <coughs> you know I can actually get her right now, uh, Uncle, but I don't want to. Because uh, if I somehow lose a 50 50 and I get a duplicate 5 star, so I don't want to use my uh, guarantee 5 star yet. <laughs> okay, let's talk to them please. It looks like a sundial. Do you think? Maybe if we spin the dials to align every pointer in the same direction. I'm going to solve this puzzle. Ah. Spinning mechanism, use a spinning device. Okay, sure. I think we can get it. Uh, we're supposed to f spin here, right? So. Ah, it's quite easy. Enough. Isn't that it? To kindle all the lights. Wait, you need to kindle all the lights? You say you need to light up all of them? I think I was right. I I I think. Oh, oh, there's another one. Okay. I I didn't realize there were three of them. <laughs> okay, then. <coughs> I thought there was only two. Okay. This is. Oh, no wonder. Cubes. Those crazy savants. They were trying to Excuse recreate me. <laughs> the retract rain. <coughs> retract rain, what the hell is it? Never thought they could pull off something like this. Incredible. The retroact rain is essentially a form of condensed remnant energy from the etheric sea. Various events across space and time from every dimension are recorded in the form of remnant energy. 
The retroact rain conjures illusions of past events for those exposed to it. That rain curtain we saw earlier was probably the result of their experiments. Before the retroact rain forms, it goes through three stages. In the first stage, it looks just like any regular rain. And what we're seeing now should be the second stage. Water droplets floating in midair, being absolutely still. I've heard of plenty of independent studies on the retroact rain. Most of the researchers were driven by their obsessions, while some wanted to relive a particular experience, and others yearned to reunite with their loved ones. But <laughs> look at all these devices here. This really makes one wonder. What on earth were they trying to bring back of such a massive retroact rain? The power oh. system here might still work. Let's split up and find it. Okay. Hooray! Willie's right away! Crystal potion, glass barometer, instant meat. Oh! Wow! A game card that went out of sale decades ago! Okay. Hey, Rover! How's it going on your end? Found anything good? It didn't take us long to solve that puzzle mechanic. Yeah, uh, thanks for your help. Oh? Do you happen to know someone from the Corte Savante? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm really looking forward to making more deals with you. I mean, Chang Li does all this weird puzzles too. But we haven't met Chang Li yet. Going up. Find a way to turn on the electricity. <laughs> oh. Cosmos? Cloudy? You saw reported in! Cosmos saw nothing! Cloudy saw nothing either! Bah. What? Go! Go look again! Wait, the Cosmos and Cloudy thing, she's doing the voice for them? <laughs> So it's like that, her toys then. <laughs> um, this thing looks familiar. What was it again? Oh. Wait. This is the gym. I want to be with this actually. There's people here. That Frank said it's over. Oh, see, there's been many generous for his sponsorship. It would have taken us much longer to build this place without him. The Fraxidus Overseer. Oh, the the Fraxidus has been helping these guys. Though he loves to meddle with <coughs> our experiments a bit too much, this lab's location is a bit too remote for me. But I'm okay with it as long as we can. Yeah. Where else could us maniacs possibly go? The committee kicked us out like trash. They'll never understand. As Professor Heisen stated, we are embarking on a monumental endeavor with the power to redefine humanity's future. This time, we will make the divine miracle we saw happen again for all of humanity to behold. What? The experiments have been going smoothly, but we still can't get the desired outcome. The artificial retroactive rain project has advanced to its second phase. We have various evidence that this ancient civilization was the whining Aix's Maya. Now, we believed we could recreate that divine miracle with the artificial retroact rain. We have no time left. The artificial controllable tacit field should be complete by now. Artificial we'll have to rely on our backup tacit. plan. But we have nothing to turn on the power with yet. The hell is this? Oh wait, this is for the other side. 
but we can't place it here. It's broken. Is there another? I get it. Can I go there? I need the other one. Hey, where the hell am I going? Did I drop it? God damn it. What the hell was that? Wait, what? It doesn't work? It has to be rain. Oh, then I need this one then. Stop pressing T. Okay, I understand, I understand. Hold up. Give me this again. Wait, there's another one here? I'll just put it there first. Might need it later. What do we got here? There's a chest here, but it's locked. Oh, because of this. Um, as long as I stand here, it's open. Can I use this? Can I just put this over here? Oh my god, it worked. Remnants of the past. Was that really how you're supposed to do it? <laughs> Alright, more people here. How subject A038 doing like it has yet to assume a concrete form or exhibit vocalization behavior. And however, we noticed some behavioral discrepancies from our initial expectations. It's merely a replica after all. It's far from the true form of those gods. They're creating in a replica god. By the way, things have been mysteriously disappearing lately. You notice it too. Thought I was imagining things. I suspect it is something to do with subject A038. Lately, its frequencies have always displayed signs of hunger, but it's been under strict surveillance. That couldn't possibly be 8038. I'll go check the security cameras. Let's increase its rations. We can't afford to let it go hungry. After all, it's our last hope now. Whatever this this artificial thing they're creating, it's hungry for something. Huh. And what is this? That's 8038. Okay. I'm not gonna read that. <coughs> Sorry. Is there anything else? Wait, what is this? Transducer. To change the colors. So now I can open the red ones. Right? Oh no, it changes this to red. Oh, it changes this thing to red. Okay, that sounds so much of okay. problems here. So now I just need one of the green ones. And I can open both doors. Now, this is the last room. What the? Oh, 
for a match? Lost in the mist of time. If this is the last room, I should go back. Remnants of the past. <laughs> Can I open the other door, please? <laughs> oh, I see. No, it's already it's already there, but I can't take it out. Okay. Well then, let's go back. <laughs> <coughs> Alright, what is this? Unlock. Oh, it's this puzzle again. Okay, so all go here. Well, they're all the same, right? <laughs> Knew it. Great. Now that power has been restored, the elevator should work. Huh. The beacon signal is coming from below. Let's go. So this replica god thing is her. This A038 thing. Is the one that we saw in the start of the game. Take the elevator to the basement. Hold on. <laughs> well. This is the elevator, okay. <coughs> oh, what is this? I have a feeling we are going to have some kind of battle here. This is like a boss arena. Is that... Are we gonna fight that? Wow! A big <coughs> clunky monster! Damn! Those savants never run out of new surprises for us. 
The signal's coming from it. Did it swallow a resonance beacon? Oh, oh, tonight. Oh, we have to battle this. Brace yourself. <laughs> we need to take it down. Can we use you guys? A uh, stronger version of you guys? Can we use a trial? <laughs> Alto, we doing it like we usually do? Yeah, of course. This time you can use Encore. <laughs> then this big guy is Encore's to tackle. Tell me we can use Encore. Cosmos, Cloudy, attack! Let me figure out <gasps> oh, let's way. go. We have a full four of them. Okay. We have a four of them. Let's go. Hold up, hold up. It's coming together from his metal parts. So how? Okay, join. Oh, okay. Destroys unstable structure. Oh, 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 oh! Holy shit, that's a lot of damage. Fuck. Okay. Hold up. Really not here. Okay, that was that was dangerous. Okay, I'm supposed to be level fifty then. I never tried it. Oh, hold What's up. What the time for? She's a long range. Oh, Uncle's gonna carry you. Okay, R. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> what is. Oh, the dark. That's the. Okay. I need to heal. Life is an everything. Okay. Uh, Who is Leave. Leave. Oh, so much fun. <laughs> Okay, I'm glad you are able to use everyone. Alka is strong. Told ya. Looks like we have to get the level fifteen. But I need to send. <sighs> Alright. But why did they keep that big guy here? That was close, I nearly lost Alto. <laughs> According to our findings earlier, researchers who worked here were probably only a small faction of the Corda Savante Committee. They were likely studying an ancient civilization they deemed to be divine beings. Or later got denounced from the CSC due to their extreme methods. Somehow, they believed this ancient civilization had once visited the mire, which led to their attempts at recreating those past events with artificial retroact rain, and when they failed to recreate the retroact rain, they resorted to making a replica of the lost civilization instead. To get their desired results faster, they started feeding this replica various frequencies, data sets, and mechanical constructs. <laughs> and we've seen what that ended up with. It turned into a monster, driven by the frequencies of hunger. Okay, now it makes uh, devouring everything more sense. In its path. So that A038 thing is this machine that we fight. And it turned to a monster. Okay. Not the one that we saw. I got confused there a moment. But this makes more sense. It was probably the culprit behind the disappearance of those folks. And I suspect the Francis Overseer mentioned in that log may have something to do with it all. Those researchers, they were too obsessed with validating the divine miracle they experienced. <coughs> they eventually got lured into the monster's frequencies of hunger. And willingly walked into its mouth. The monster devoured them, but not with its teeth. Their own delusions and fear were their undoing in the end. <laughs> what a crazy bunch. So, Rover, now it's time for me to fulfill my promise. What do you want to know about the Black Shores? 
What does the blood source do? As you already know, we monitor and research the lament. And we've got okay, we know that one, yes. set up in every nation worldwide. The island our headquarters are built on is in fact a massive piece of tacitite ore which powers our various energy intensive operations. This lake bloom is a product of that overflowing energy on the island. Oh. Our island is located in the perfect spot to accurately monitor the lament, ensuring precise prediction. That being said, the lament's behavior is constantly changing, and we are still studying to understand its true nature. All we can do for now is observe the lament, study its patterns, and provide early warnings to countries worldwide. Oh. About the Black Shores. Have you been stalking me? I think everyone in the Black Shores has been. Alright, alright. No more beating around the bush. Yeah. We've had our eyes on you. But please, trust me. We don't mean anything bad. We just wanted to make sure you're a dependable ally. The Black Shores members all work together to save the world from a lament crisis. We've got talents from all walks of life, including skilled hackers, explosive experts, and even feng shui masters. You name it, we have it. We like your skills and methods. So what do you say? Ready to jump on board? What do you want to know about the Black Shores? Do you know a person named Cam Camellia, yeah? Camellia? Camellia. Of course okay, we do. We pronounce Camellia. Okay. Yeah. She can be kind of unhinged, but she's indeed one of ours. Just so you know, she only took up this mission because of you. Quite the charmer, aren't you? She almost killed me, so she wasn't dying. So you've met her already? Nice. Save me some time introducing. What do you want to know about the Black Shores? We just received a warning from our lament detection system. Another Thronodian is about to arrive near Jinjo Jinjo City. <laughs> So, we came here to inform Jinjo's magistrate about it. Oh, they, they mentioned to the magistrate. Yes, entire countries have been destroyed. We're not letting such tragedies happen again. What do you want to know about the Black Shores? I'm just an insignificant consultant at the Black Shores, so I don't know that much about all its okay. hidden secrets, but I believe... The piece of intel I'm about to share with you will make this trip worth your effort. This is not the first time you've been reawakened. Not the first time? Last time, you woke up at the Black Shores. Uh, this is not the first time you've been reawakened. You woke up at the Black Shores. Rover, we share the same goal. We're both aiming to fight against the Thernodians and prevent the Lament Crisis. Yep! Onkar can prove it! The Thrinodian is a bad, bad guy, and Ankar and Alto are the heroes of justice! So we're gonna stop the bad guys! I understand. Trust isn't something you could afford to give out that easily. Remember the Blake Bloom I gave you earlier? It's more than just a symbol. It also holds the key to our headquarters. I'm sure it'll come in handy for you. Phew! Anyway, mission accomplished! We've got the Resonance Beacon secured, plus a sweet bonus of Corda Savante's big secrets. Mm. Glad I got you on board, Rover. Looking oh. forward to our future collaborations. Got as well. Oops, almost forgot. Gotta check the Resonance Beacon again, just in case. Wait, this is... Hmm? No, it can't be. What is hey, it? Hey, Alto, wait! Trial left the party. Well, Uncle left. I have also here. Nearly lost. Level 30 was so not enough. And what We're still not done with Act 5. So, meet Alto at the entrance. We're going back up. Wait, how the hell do I get? <coughs> oh yeah, okay.
What does that mean? Will this cancel a certain quest or something? That was weird. <laughs> Encore heard lightning. When there's lightning, it's gonna rain. And when it's gonna rain, Encore should bring an umbrella. Oh, no, 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 no. Alto said when it rains like this, we hide. The rain. No. This is. What is this? It's the real restaurant rain. Oh. Melver. Jinjo. Huh? Jinjo is under attack. What? It's a TD outbreak. Oh, shit. And that's the end of Act 5. Oh. That's not good. It is natural. Straight jumping to X6. This rain, it's finally happening. GM. General, yes, how's it going? We have 500 remaining soldiers prepared and medically cleared for combat. After receiving the antidote for retroact rain, they have reported minimal hallucinations and no adverse effects. However, a few veterans still reported sporadic sightings of phantoms in the rain. Oh, that's what these these are. Okay. I see. Stay alert. We will continue as planned. Report any signs of potential TD outbreaks immediately. We march on to the North Fall Barrens as soon as the rain stops. Aye, sir. Okay. It's happening everywhere. Where's GN? What? Stronger emotional connection to the affected area leads to more intense hallucinations. That's what they said. I should go for another round of inspection. Make sure everything is going as planned. We're starting at 6. Oh shit. I want to uh, end this here, but we are starting already with at 6 with GN. I don't know what will this <laughs> gonna go like. Let's see the map. It's right there, huh? Well, I can't really uh, start. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Okay. All right. Um, how do I do this? Should I see what this is about? And then continue X6 another time. I can't even attack. You know what? I think I'll continue this another video. X6 is gonna be. <laughs> I can't wait to try X6, but yeah, it's quite late really for me now. So yeah, to be continued uh, X6 on another video, alright? That's it for Act 5 of that uh, chapter. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.